and Chris. We're back at the bowl after a, a, a road trip last week, and we've probably got one of the biggest games of the season. The yeah. Leaders, the leaders yeah. First of all, was, yeah. First of all, see, it was a very good road trip last week. We won five one quite comfortably in the end, um, up against a, a decent side. They played some good football at times, but didn't really create that much against us. But now with the team, you know, West Didsbury today, you know, champions elect. It's for theirs to uh, you know, chuck away here today. We're going to be giving everything we can and try and get a decent result. But this is what we play football for. This, this is the sort of level of games that we want to be playing every week. Yeah. And of course, they were the first team to beat us and they give us a bit of a hiding, really, at their place back in August. They did. They did and they didn't. Although they were very good, um, we hit the bar, the post, and had a penalty, which is very dubiously ruled out by the linesman rather than the referee because the referee gave it. Then I think it was one nil at half time, and then Sean got sent off. I don't, I can't remember when it was two or three nil before he got sent off. But we were down to ten men. Again, we didn't have the same system as we have now. But make no mistake, these are a good team. Yeah, it's going to be a tough game. But the bigger game, probably our biggest home game since our opener against Brockton, and it looks as if ticket sales are going through the roof. It looks as if we're going to have well over two thousand here tonight, which is. Wow, I was hoping you were going to say well over three, but there you go. <laughs> we can't do well over, no, we can't no, do over no. three. <laughs> no, but no, I think I think people will be uh, impressed with the team that we play tonight. And that's that's what we want on the island, man. We want a good standard of football every week. And it would give encouragement to the kids and younger players to come through and want to be involved in this kind of league. Yeah. Conditions tonight, very blustery as we talk here, about an hour and a half before kick-off. Any yeah. concerns about that? Yeah, yeah, it can be it can be very difficult. It depends on how well we can keep the ball on the floor. It depends whether you've got the wind at your back or you're going into it. We'll just have to look and assess how we play, or you know, take to the take the weather the weather conditions into consideration. Because really. you can't go gun ho if you're going into the wind. Yeah, the political yeah. Yeah. Chris, all the very best, and we'll talk after we get. Thanks very much, Steve. Cheers, Chris. Thank you.